Welcome back to I Wanna Lockpick, which is a cursed game about perfectly opening doors. This is part of a massive series already, so I'll try to explain not too much, although I already I already put up a cursed view in there. Anyway, so we have one pure key. You can think of it as white key right now. Um, but yeah, the white key can open up these bicolored doors to give us some negative key. What? Okay, so it just... Right, well, sure, that got put in the overworld. I guess, okay. So it can put a door on the overworld. I, I mean, I I guess they accidentally hit this. But to solve the level normally, I'll of course need to go to the end of all of these to get each uh, pure key. So, they, we also have these blank doors in the way. A blank pure door. So I'll need to do this, then sacrifice it to have no cyan keys again. Although I can go and collect these whenever I want, um, but we need it to be exactly zero to make the blank door work. Now, we could collect these in waves, I'm pretty sure. So we, we can take this pink door. Oh, we don't even have a pink right now. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> like, don't we have a limited number of doors? Like, there's a certain order that we need to do to get access to all of these. Like, purple is not immediately accessible from here either. So... Let's take this, then get rid of purple. Hmm. This could get really annoying fast. Uh, I could get rid of this. I could take another orange. This is just like my first attempt. Like, it might not work out, and there might need to be a certain order. That is what I'm going to be expecting. So you do that. Well, we have cyan right here. Although, this is the most suspicious thing. This is actually really sticks out. Wait, what the hell? Something's really weird with this. There is a normal blank cyan door right there. So, what the hell does that mean? Okay, I'm gonna reset back and try to open this. Like, what is even going on here? This actually doesn't even seem possible to me. You would do this. Break these doors first. Now we would need to break some other door. I collected pink and broke this, okay? Like, even having two purples doesn't do anything. These are just going to be minus one each time. We can access another cyan. Hmm. We can try to access the purple ahead of schedule by breaking here. Wait! Hmm. Maybe the ahead of schedule thing is the idea because... Look at how I... I I've screwed myself over in the sense that these cyans can no longer be broken. But, of course, if we made it there first, then we wouldn't have this problem. Okay, well, I try to run where I go over here and break these first. But, doesn't that have the very clear problem? Wait, no, 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 no. It's because I... Oh my god, can't do math properly. <laughs> it's because I don't need... I, ca I can skip one of the keys because I already had a pure key in there. Oh my god. Okay. Well, I can go here, here. Imagine the bottom one is the one that breaks. That'd be freaking hilarious. Not really. Oh, although we do need blanks on the very end, so... Hmm. Oh, hmm. Well, this got cursed. Uh, we are almost there, except... You can clearly see that we are minus one purple key and and one cyan key. But this will fail at the very end. Because we need to have zero of all of these at the very end. This, this like, this is impossible. Like, it, it presents you in, like, going... Prison from taking two tunnels. This, this bottom is a troll, <laughs> probably. It gives that vibe. Um, despite, yeah, I don't know. We're probably also getting the purple early. Like we get a negative purple early on, or something, or earlier than we get this key anyway. I don't really, partially don't know why then that I wouldn't just pick. I'm just gonna go through like a random tunnel here and then get rid of orange. The specific order in which it collects stuff. <laughs> But here we can break all of these. Okay, I guess we can't break pink because I didn't plan that well enough. We kind of don't care about cyan status because we get gain enough cyan anyway. Yeah, I can break this as well. Okay. Now I'm at negative one purple, so I can go through here and break that. And that. Got, uh, don't like that I got that one. Hmm. We have zero pink, so we can go through this one. And now, uh, because we have negative one cyan, we go, we go here and here. And... Cyan blank? Oh. Hmm. I mean, sure. But now just pick everything up, and we have purple, two pinks, and one cyan. Two pinks. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, damn it, damn it, damn it. Hmm. 
Okay, so like we ended up with an extra negative purple, so we don't we don't spend the store. I don't even know how to mark this, but let's draw an X here or something. We are not gonna take that purple anymore. We're gonna get it from elsewhere or something. So we do that. Uh, do something like this for to get rid of the purple there. And then we should be fine, honestly. Get rid of these. Now we have zero for these, which is good. Uh, we're gonna need to get that orange at some point anyway. I think this will get it though. Because we, we're definitely not getting that purple anymore. And getting these, uh, these are gonna be pretty easy. Sorry the first level is gonna take a little longer than I want. Uh, okay. Get rid of that. Okay. Now break these open. Gain this. You're going to need to break a... Uh, one of these, obviously. Break one of these. We're also going to need to get rid of that. And this should be it, right? Yeah, okay. There it is. Okay, and for the last cyan, you take the one in front of this. And there we go. We have four pier keys and complete blankage for this. Now, what... what, what, what hmm. What is the thing selected for you? We have a negative master key. Well, I guess the negative master key can be used on any door ever. So, wait, no, no, because that's a pure. Okay, 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 okay. So the pure freaking the the fact that the door is a pure component means that it cannot be infected by a master key. So we need to get that blank cyan door to interact with the input point. <laughs> okay, okay, that's why things are pure in this freaking level. All right. So now we spend these. In fact, does it matter that like I spent anything else? I do wonder, because don't I just like go here? Not care about any other key status? Alright. Um, and then I activate this over input point, which will set the overworld uh thing at the output to the next door I open. Which is what's called a door salvagement. And now here's the blank cyan door. It also varies in size apparently so i'm sure we can expect some nice platforming that's forced i want a lock pick is not a platformer anyway so we now we have spent our negative master key so we have zero master keys left to use this door and now we have this level corner case cool some doors are still frozen the real heat all right what, what are it says corner case so i bet we're gonna be in the corner and then unfreeze that uh-huh uh-huh we have a master key that can break a blank door, but we can also go here. Does it matter which we use? We can go back up like that. We also have a 5 plus 1 eye blue key. <laughs> a blast door that can gets rid of all of the real component, but not any of the imaginary component. Hmm. Well, I mean, it looks kind enough. Oh, does that destroy my master keys? Hmm. Oh, hmm, but... Why did they change the red key to be maroon? <laughs> this is a glitch door that costs all of the keys that you last used. So in this case, I last opened a red door, so this door is red. Hmm. These are painted, re requiring three blues to break the painting. The painted means that it can't be interacted with until you break the painted effect. Okay, well, we're already stuck, unfortunately. I don't even know how to get past this stuff. <clears throat> so we got three master keys, though. So we just use the master key to break the blank door. And then what the hell do you do with the white keys? Do you just not pick the white keys up? Hmm. I'm not completely sure what's going on here. I know it's a mimic door, which can break the blue. But then what do you do here? This level seems uh, very conflicting. I don't even know how you get green keys. Why do you have green stuff? It's freaking one eye. Why is it two eye? Wait, this itself is also a glitch key. I didn't even notice. Hmm. We also have an erosion effect. The eroded is is something. It's just like it's exactly like painted, except it requires five green instead of three blue to destroy. So we need to do that too. What the hell? How are we gonna find five? We okay? I guess the blue key is here. So we need to make it green. I think. Well then, if you need to make it green, then is it any different? Like, we go here, we need to break that, I guess. So far, for some reason, I don't know how to get through either tunnel. Like doing this, breaking that, and then we still have a door in the way. I guess we could, we could change it to blue, then grab this blue, 
Aha, uh -huh, okay. So now we have a blue that can break that. Okay, now we have three master keys, which is really good. Now that we also this is a zero, so we can break this, this, open this up. But now, hmm, let's undo that. And then break this, so this turns back into a blue door. Okay, now we break the blue portion of this. Now we now we have zero white and zero blue, so we can break the blank blue and blank white here. Now we have another three, and I don't know how to break these three blue keys. Five white keys. We still have erosion, too. Like, do, do we need to keep our green? I will admit the master thing is suspicious. It's a blast door, so of course, the idea would be you do that, and now we can see that door. Uh, however, we are screwed. Like, we are, we've been screwed for a long time because we don't have the five green keys. Let's try something else from the start. Let's try getting rid of the blue side first. Then, we'll be able to, like... We can turn this key back into a green one if we just open a green door. And we, in fact, have many opportunities to do that. Now, open that. Oops, not there. Okay. Here, get another three. We can change to a white. Not that that seems good. Now flip that so we can get access to green keys. But still, don't open this. Like, we want... Hmm. We want this to be different. Even if it does cost a master key to get in. Okay, I'm indecisive, so we're gonna open back the green stuff. <laughs> okay, let's say we have three. Then we don't have a blue to break. What if we break a blank door with the master? It doesn't even change this to blue. Fine. Break it, because we need green. <sighs> From here, we can break a blank. Let's turn it back. Okay, okay, okay. We got the green. We can break this. And then we can open this. We need the five greens, so we're going to need... Well, we probably need to use the master there. Then go through this. Get access to three more blue... Why is this... Oh, no, hold on. We No, no right, right. We can break this blue again. I, I, I understand they're made out of multiple blank pieces, so the glitch key can uh, work out multiple times. Which one to break? There's no blank master door, right? You do that. And then you... Break another blank, so this turns back into a blue. Okay. And then we have these with the cost... What do you mean, one master? No, 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 because they need one... Okay, they need one master... Wait a minute. What the hell? Am I, I going to lose all my master keys going through this? Hmm. I mean, okay. Like, three, we can break this. I don't know what to think about this. Actually, no, 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 we, we already have the master keys. So we can just go through here. And these convert their cost into white keys. So, like, normal... If they were just normal doors, they would reduce master key by one. But because they're meme doors, they redirect it to minus wanting the white keys instead. Now we can break this. That requires no white keys. Now we spend our master keys to... At this point, like, it's so predictable that you do that. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's very blatant hint text. So we got we picked up five white keys to reduce our white keys to zero, and now it's pretty easy. There you go. So that is the meme level there. What is the next level? It just can't wait. Always look back. Eight eight eight. What do you mean? Remember the past? This is very reminiscent of the past, but it doesn't look anything like it. I think the level had the same ish layout, but. And okay, the winning winning is easy. The salvaging is not. How do? Hmm. How point six? What is this thing? I swear this this game is only there to show off some cursed door types. Blank pure. Do I do I? Okay, so I need negative eight cyan keys and no pure keys to unlock that one. This requires no blue keys, but also requires three blue keys <laughs> to break the painted effect off of it. Speaking of blue keys, I mean, we do have some in here. This doesn't seem like an area I'm going to access right now. What the hell? Don't forget the store's minus one copies. Uh-huh. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. That one door is the one blocking the... Okay. I like how the 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 white, the, the, the blank pier in the middle blends in the background so it doesn't look like a door is hiding. We have a very suspicious key that cannot be hovered over that some fool might complain about if I use it as a thumbnail. Yeah, I don't know, like, 
go here. Oh, wait. What? Multiple copies of the sixth door. And then some blue and pure keys. Oh, great. Why? Well, I can't get back up. Luckily, you can press R. Okay, well, we, we look at the hub enough. What is exactly the thing that we are trying to copy into the overworld? <laughs> Pink. We have, we've seen... Well, that's too easy, right? Hmm. If we were just copying that one. No, it's got to be a, an annoying one that takes effort like that one. Don't you just love when games have official cursed effects? Anyway, so that's an easy way to get a door salvaged into the overworld. And then you would require eight pink. Uh, and we do have pink keys on the overworld. So that's just like, we could go here. But this, wait a minute, this gives negative. Well, okay, I guess we have to get some sense. It gives purifying brown, it gives negative brown keys. And negative brown keys purify things. Uh-huh. You know, the fact that it's 18-4 really makes it feel like... It's it's using that... I don't understand the pure keys in there. That's a bit concerning. But at least for the 18, that implies the blue door. Is we have like six copies of that, of uh, of the output point. So therefore, this blue door is seems like the one that will be targeted for... Like, it's going to be the one that we put in the overworld. To be honest, I think this puzzle will be even better if it looks like a puzzle that is completely different, but then it's solved the exact same way as the previous one. It's quite annoying there are eight copies of this door. And, of course, two, imag uh, two imaginary copies, which require some imaginary keys to break. This is a combo master door, which also means it's possible to make this give a different number of master keys than expected. I think, when you break it. Eight negative master keys is sure a lot. But I can also turn them to imaginary master keys. Why is it that I can go beneath this one? Wait. Oh, maybe I can't. All right, well, anyway. Just going casually and saying goodbye. Uh, so, to use a negative imaginary master key, we need to switch to eye view by pressing Q or whatever you bound it to. And then you have an imaginary copy with an imaginary cost. How would I even find imaginary brown keys in the first place to even open these? If I were to, like, use these. Hmm. Maybe we should, like... Okay, so imagine getting rid of all my brown keys. Then I can open this, right? Yes! I can open that because it has a blast ma negative master. It, the blast negative master destroys all my master keys. But there's also a negative two master key lock on it. This being a combo door, both effects happen at the same time. And so if you lose negative two master keys, that cancels out, that gives you plus two master keys at the end of it. <laughs> now, does it let you get past these doors? These are the required negative eight and no browns. <sighs> can make it two I, and these are positive two I. And um, don't, don't all these have a master component on them? Ugh, that means that I cannot even apply the... <clears throat> well, I can't apply the... I can't apply the imaginary master key to imaginarily break an imaginary copy. But I can't open it now, surprisingly. It has a cost of 8 pink, but redirects the master, giving us negative 8, and a sign of no visual UI design appreciation. But hey, if we have negative 8 master keys now, we are then capable of breaking this. And there is our 3. Okay, okay. Thank you for giving me the ability to break that. Now, uh, <laughs> it's cursed, so this requires a negative... No, no, hmm. I mean, I could add an imaginary copy, but... No, it doesn't. That's not an imaginary copy. That's just a thing that breaks it. Yeah, a, a... Oh, my God. A positive imaginary master key is capable of breaking positive imaginary copies of doors, obviously. Well, it doesn't solve the problem that I need to break this brown door by having no brown keys. Then it'll reset the brown keys to zero for some reason, even though it should already be zero when you open it. Then... Then break, probably with brown neg... No, 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 brown imaginary keys to break the imaginary copies, or... Uh, actually, probably would make more sense to use the 2i master keys to break the 2i copies here. And then, I don't know what to do with the times 8. The times 8 probably suggests that we use, we use 8 real master keys. 
Well, maybe seven real master keys to have one left. Do you think messed up UI is a sign that this is the wrong path? <laughs> also, really dumb prediction I'm gonna make right now. They're, they're gonna do something with the X. It's gonna be a variable at some point. <laughs> That'd be an excellent reveal. Hmm. So, I do notice that having Z. No, 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 not. not <laughs> I didn't mean that door. This door. It is nothing behind it. So if we're gonna make copies of a door, it should maybe be this one. Because again, that allowed that what I did allowed me to get rid of all my brown keys, allowed me to not curse this door, giving me some negative brown keys to use later. Just negative master keys for opening that. Uh, we probably should have made even more copies then. <laughs> hmm. No, 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 no. Why, why do I keep doing this in the wrong order? What, what the hell am I even doing? <laughs> Break that, you get negative eight, which allows us to open this up, and that that gives us extra master keys. Hmm. We can of course then break this, though, though this uh, converts it to brown, so that removes Alder Brown. Hmm. There's some I, okay, and then we can go back here and get negative eight minus thirteen I. And huh. Ah, huh, wait a minute. That's a, something that's like com weirdly compatible with this door, because what this door does is it sh like it changes it so you gain negative two. It also turns that to two i. Oh, because we broke the real copy first, then the imaginary, then one of the ninety nine imaginary copies, which also set our imaginary to two i. So I guess we're fine with the imaginary part, but I don't know how like. Do you need to make imaginary copies of this door? No, we want- no, we have negative imaginary copies. <laughs> Wait! No, no! Oh my god, please. I want to somehow be able to break this door, then get more negative master keys. No, oh, no, wait, no! Oh god, if only we were able to create more master keys to break this part. We can use the- uh, the- the 2i to break this part, so... We're getting closer. It's also worth them, like... Hmm, the time's also... Actually, the time's actually even more worrying, because what? Do we need to make things right before we pick up with this, or... Well, anyway. The point is that we have to clear out all of these areas before we can get to three blue keys. So, anything that matters is involving a change to these. Probably gaining more copies of this door. And we can't gain copies of it while it's in master state, so we need to do it while it's in curse state. Okay. Well, that's some. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if we have enough to do that, actually. But four copies of that and should allow that to work. Okay, to spare you from a minute of nonsense, uh, four wasn't enough because it turns out that I need negative master keys to open this door, so I need even more copies of this door. God, if only I knew a level that did this. So, <laughs> make some copies of, I don't freaking know, here. No, 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 here. We, although we will need to make copies of the bottom door as well. But we will need to spend as much as possible to get there. Here. Okay. Now, we have negative brown, which will restore the qualities of those doors. Hmm. I have brown. We're here to add copies to this door. It's like everything is restored to its previous position or something, I don't know. I need to make more copies of this thing. Now get to negative eight and clear this. Negative eight brown keys. Uh, do we have too many copies of this door? Um, I mean... Seems like a reasonable number to me. Uh, we are lacking two eye of the master keys somehow i don't even know how the hell that happened we probably need to like convert something to i and here or something okay does this work please say it does <laughs> uh we've cleared out that we have eight keys which is plenty enough to activate this i'm pretty sure three now we have two and uh i don't really understand the zero brown we can use that 2i. Whoa. 
How do I get master? Right, I need more copies of the, the master door. Well, it's okay. We can just make more. Jeez. How rude. All right, then I just, like, open everything as normal. Right? With my four copies, that should be enough. Wait, I forgot to blank. I forgot to uncurse this door. <laughs> but not open it. Ugh! There you go. All right. Should be good, right? Eight. Eight. Need, th need three blue keys for this. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Okay. So, so. Here. Open it up. To... You know, ho hopefully I can use my eye keys to get rid of the eye parts of the door. Now, eight. Come on, I have two. Hold on. Uh, we we want to do this. Okay, I think we have it. I swear, <laughs> I swear. Uh, two. Break with the master keys and with the final copy of this, I go here. I have negative eight. Uh, if I have any negative at all, I can break this into two masters, and that's enough. Yeah, let's activate this now. <sighs> Chess battle advanced. Alright, there it is. There's a freaking door. So down here, I don't even know how to take care of the pure keys. <laughs> but hey, here it is. Here's that done. Uh, <laughs> I... <sighs> How? We have four pure keys left, and I don't freaking know how to get rid of them. Is there a way to change the, um... I mean, this requires a blank. Which is actually weird. Why do I still have three keys? I mean, I must have need to pick up that one master key, and then copy a blue. But even with that, we are apparently going to need a way to... Oh, wait. Hmm. I'm pretty sure... Well, no, I'm not. I am not sure at all. Okay, so... We are, we, okay, we're just turning this pure key, uh, the pure door into the one in the overworld. Alright. I just love when meta in video game means good job and hope you enjoy uh, redoing level you already did. Well, anyway, we have pure, four pure keys now. Boom. Okay, so now we are also going to pick up our one master key to copy whatever any door. Then grab both of these go here, use this path to get back up once we get rid of all of our blue keys. Boom. And now with our f four pure keys in the inventory, we need to get rid of the four pure keys, so blam, and it's gone. Alright. What's this now? Little stones. W wait. Stone doors! <laughs> A nice piece of meta. Awesome. So you got stone keys for beating worlds in the entire first part of the game. Now the joke is, oh, well, here here they are in a level. Though we need to have 24 white keys or more, and no pure and no stone keys. I don't even have a choice here. I have to do this. Then I have to pick up the five brown. I could convert this white to stone converter or this. Hmm. That doesn't open, and we are never going to curse that door because it requires a cost and a blank. Why does the purple feel like a bait? We'll, we'll take it anyway. How do we even get rid of the 24 browns? It's not a glitch key, so... I'd, I'd love to convert that brown. But we already got rid of our conversion door here. This is a master... Wait. Okay, this, this is a pure part of the door. Uh, things with a, any pure part cannot be broken by a master key. This level is so weird. Like... <laughs> negative copy? Help, how do blank out the browns? Okay, well, that's, that's weird. Uh, what if we break this instead? Then this could be spent... We could double it, but 24 doesn't go into 15. I mean, 5. Like, is there a meme way to get rid of stone keys before you entered this? Door facts. Unfortunately, skeleton keys could not be encountered in Journey, as we could not source the necessary skeleton parts. <laughs> so, we could actually use this master key to break open this door. Let's see if we can do anything about that. So, let's break that door. Wait, we <laughs> need it first. Uh, we really need to get these brown keys first. Now, I I don't know what to do now. Like, you could convert that into a blast door and get rid of it. But how do you get 12 stone keys? You're supposed to find that in the overworld or something? I mean, look, I, I can go through here now. 
But that's not useful. If I can get rid of all of my stone keys, then I can make... I can turn master keys into negative stone keys. But that, that's not even that many negatives I can make. I, I'm not sure. I don't even like breaking that with the masters either. Well, okay, let's go back to the start. I love how if you go, if you rage quit and come back, you start from here and have to walk all the way back to where you were. Anti-rage quit technology. Well, I am coming back here for a reason, and it's not the beautiful tree that's yellow. What do you mean? Just sleep on the grass next to the- yes, yes. Chest battle advanced. Well, don't leave any leaves. Okay. <laughs> Sure. Cosmic Hand of Fate. Uh, anyway, the reason I'm back here is so I could ask you if maybe there's a way I can get rid of stone keys. I got- yeah, so this is a conversation that you might have if you get your first stone key. Why does this game have me in it? Uh, anyway. Yes, the idea is basic. No. Maybe. Don't worry. <laughs> fake worlds? What's fake worlds? Art of- it's every immersive world is air conditioned. The, what this is very useful lore. Okay. It tasted like candy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure. What a kind god. <laughs> Disappearing candy. Cool. So so maybe eating imaginary burgers could cure the weight gain. Like I don't know. Like the, it being stone keys is so meta, in an unnecessary way, right? But we know that going through levels, like for example, going in here, then checking the status, stone keys turn back into eleven every time you go through a door or anything. So like, am I supposed to like uncomplete a world? That's stupid, and not even something I know how to do. This requires eleven stone keys to go through anyway. Wait. Oh, there's a chapter two. Okay, cool. Nice fast travel. There's a really hard puzzle here that I have already uh, made. Well, a lyrics finale on. Um, it does not have a stone key or whatever behind it. So, God, like, we, we what do we do? Like, I guess we just convert this to brown so that the master keys are gone from the equation. Break that open. Now, we, because, because we have five white keys. Wait, <gasps> whoa, we can use the blast stone door to get rid of all of our stone keys at this point, giving us negative uh, five stone keys because this converts the five white cost into a cost of stone. Hmm. Oh, that's what the stone door is doing. And then we do it twice, right? We double that door so that the 12, uh, we have 24 brown keys, so we just use the negative master key to use it twice. Okay, so it was just a normal puzzle that I just, like, didn't see the solution for whatever reason, even though it should have been simple. Alright. Okay. So, what is next, even? I guess this is next. What What is this for? Combo Cyan, I mean, I guess just to get rid of Cyan. Also, we need to press R because we can't leave that normally due, due to lacking a negative master key. Okay, so, here... Wait, no, no, next level is here. Tricky inputs. Look forward to the platforming. Oh no. Ah, here's the input points. Alright, input points can be quite pesky. There's no way to turn one off if you happen to bump it, but but if you bump another one, it'll change the destination for the salvage. And well, the win is right there, thank you. But of course, what we need to do is find some way. Well, there well, this means there is multiple things that are right here. And whatever we do probably involves this, so we need to get rid of pure keys twice? Uh, get rid of pink keys, I mean. Then get rid of black keys. The fact that as a pure outline just means that you can't use a master key on it. We also have some more insane omega key tees, in case I didn't look at that earlier. <laughs> what the f- <laughs> hmm. Either we're using with that omega key, or there's legit 999 key thing on there. Cool. So I'm kind of scouting to see if there's, like, we need to use three doors to break this entire thing, obviously. So, I think our current resources are not enough, and we are also going to need to change the values of other levels. But, like, the, the values here are obviously too low. We need to get a little bit of, like, 50 pink keys each, and, uh, six black keys. Hmm, what the hell is this? This is a joke. Okay, like, I know that I don't open this door yet, but how do you get both positive and negative? keys in the same inventory. It's not possible with what I know. What about this level? Get 
point. We can convert stuff to brown. Be blue. I don't understand that level either. In in the sense that it, if it does even help this, whatever this is. And why is there a pure key? Negative pure key. Why? I mean, okay, for, for this level, we definitely know that we want the black door, right? So this one, we definitely need it. And then, well, I don't really know why a black a blast door isn't enough. Or like one of the negative blast doors. Like if, if that's not enough, the obvious other choice would be that this is another thing that we would want to turn overworld object to, but that's only two objects. I, I don't know what to do. So, I mean, there's also multiple input points, which is weird. Does this mean, wait, oh, that, oh, whoa. What, what if it's you, what if it's the ability to stand on multiple input points that are the same? And then when it comes out, you, you can imagine activating that and then two copies of the door go into the overworld. That would make a lot of sense. Of course, that does mean that we are going to need... Alright, let's 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 swap the numbers on here. As the all pink door is definitely going to be where the seven input is. I just want to think of how to like even make progress through this. We got two keys. That's a negative, which is not good. The input points right now are obstacles. Let's undo, I don't know. Maybe the negative master can help? I'm not sure. I'm in the same position as before. I don't know what to do with these pink keys. All right, back from the start. Um, here, we, we're going to destroy the blast door because we have no other choice. The other path is a dead end. Okay. There's a negative blast pink door that can let me get rid of negative keys. Well, now we're at negative one. This is the thing that I would suspect gets... Copied. I don't know why it just feels that way. Oh, we have like no keys left actually. Okay, wait, no, no, no. Obviously that was wrong. We do need to have some keys here. Okay, now we have five, but we can turn this into negative two using the purple door that redirects to pink. So that goes there. I can break this. I have negative keys. Here I can break a blast purple. Red. Oh, but well, that was easy. Ish. Uh, what's with all the other stuff? Like the purple door with a minus three pink cost. Well, hmm. Also, another weird thing is why do we have three sevens? I thought we only needed two. Hmm. Or maybe the idea that I was thinking of just doesn't work. No, it doesn't work. So what the what what even is going on? Oops, I didn't even mean to do that. God damn it. Okay, so clearly this thing though, it needs six purples, so we need to preserve six purples by the time we get here. We already were not at the best time to get six purples, because we need to have zero purples at this point. I don't even know how that could happen, because the time that we got negative purples was all the way back here. Still doing the steps that I all previously did, obviously. Hmm, maybe it's this thing. This is interesting. This costs negative pink, so if I swap pink, then I get, can get to purple. Yeah, now it's negative, which is the cost you need for these redirection doors. Hmm. So now these are purple doors that change to pink. Uh, negative purple doors that redirect. No, no, no. Neg <laughs> negative pink doors that redirect to purple. So now we have six purple keys, as planned. And we do need to break the... Oh, shoot. Um, I don't have this pink door in here. I guess that's no problem. We can go here and then break this, because we only need to have at least three pink, uh, pink keys to use this little machine here that gives us six purple keys. Now we break all the black to have zero black due to the blank door, the blank black door here. So now we have access to this in perfect spot, but, but no! <laughs> hey, yo, has anyone found any pur purple keys on the overworld? Sorry, that was extremely stupid, <laughs> but, um, but, but, but then how? Wait, negative master key. That's what it is. Okay, that's what it's for. Maybe. Yeah, because um, salvaging doesn't work on keys that have additional copies. Alright, so we do the exact same thing, but with less brain damage. Add. Boom. Okay, so now we have the six black keys, and there's... I mean, this forces this one to be the one that we open. Now, um, um, for this situation where we need two things and will definitely be the all door the poke all pink doors we have no way to duplicate it in the there's a negative master key on the overworld <laughs> okay well that's that's that one solid we basically cleared the board before so we can do it again and well i guess i'm glad that it's easy to achieve 
So all you need to do is, you know, pick any one of them and then open this up. All right. Now let's grab the master key, which I can do faster by pressing R. There it is. Should work out. So now we have the 50 pink keys. Do I have to jump over the four negative pure keys? Like, what's going on? I'm pretty sure that doesn't matter for the purposes of the blank door at all. We can break it again, though. Yep. And now, this door. The, the lack of sprint jumping is very, rel very noticeable here. Doors are retrospective. Nice, a guest puzzle. <laughs> yes, the filler puzzles. It takes a strong will to keep up with the, the things this game is doing. So, okay, we now have an infinite negative one master key because it is starred. So this negative one will stay a negative one. So we can make as many copies of these as we want. Hmm. What are those? They Okay, they, they turn one color to the other. Okay, math problem is lockpick level. Woohoo. And then we have unstar, so we can't use that anymore. And now... Well, hold on. Can you jump... Can you make this... Yeah, that's a thing, sure. <laughs> now that's a helpful thing. And now, these uh, are converter doors that convert all of your white key into negative orange. And you can do it as many times as you want, and then you can do it on this one as well. And then, you're going to need a blank of the rest. So, hope you enjoy the math, because... This is the nonsense we have to do today. <laughs> this is the level that's meant to filter out all the non-mathematicians. This is a sort of hatred-stoking game <laughs> against non-mathematicians. Well, here we have Fibonacci numbers. I mean, it'd be real funny if one of... It's not gonna hit the Fibonacci numbers. I can't wait for the secret over here. Oh. <laughs> we can probably code the problem away as well. It's just annoying that, like, there's two choices at every branch that you do in this. And, like, I don't even know how I would, like, do the math to make sure that, like, like you can't get anything from two editions that could be anywhere. At least, to me, it means nothing that the numbers are exactly these totals. So, I'm just gonna play around and, uh, and break the box. Yeah, sure. That's a good idea, right? Maybe if it gets long enough, I can use the text as a, like a as the thing I can stand on. Oh, oh, oh! Shoot, decimals! Some somehow decimal came through. The floating point number broke, etc., etc. <laughs> See, I knew decimals existed in lockpick. They just didn't want to tell us about it. Uh, also, maybe we're the numbers are the playable characters the whole time. It would make a lot of sense. So if the numbers hit the the check mark, then we win. See. Okay, anyway, why can't Google decide what font it wants to use on the freaking web pages? Anyway, our goal numbers are, uh, you know, 5, 8, 872 and 383, so maybe we can reverse engineer with differences, but it is, like, not the most effective thing, because it's very possible that there's going to be a step that requires two of the same duplication. Alright, I've come up with this professionally edited a dollar a day menial work. So, <laughs> the orange is a 383. So, the orange is also the negative three. Uh, so, to make a negative three, we need to use this a bunch of times, then do this. to set white to ten without, you know, destroying the freaking door. Because for some reason, we gotta use the manual work of the master key. Also, apparently I made a mistake and the other one should be white, so that really shows how much I know about anything. No, 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 not four. Gosh. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I know one of them is three, and the other gets to seven somehow. Then we get to ten and seven, which gets to ten and seventeen, which gets to twenty-seven, which gets to forty-one. That doesn't even add to forty-one. What the hell? Okay, no, no, we were supposed to have seventeen. And, yeah, seventeen and seven, which is correct. Then it gets to twenty-four, <laughs> but but not at seven. Here, here's twenty-four. Here's forty-one. Okay, no, no, hold on. Don't destroy a door, because for some reason there's still not copies. <laughs> okay, now I have 65 times 3. So we use 65 multiple times to change this number into... The... <laughs> no, no, it was, it was 106 multiple times. Yes, there it is! I personally can't wait for math to be automated out of existence. Alright, here it is. Wait, no, you didn't see the satisfying part. Here it is. <laughs> Alright. 
Okay. So now that that's open, we can get stuck because you're a jerk. Ah, right then. Precipice of the Blizzard. Ah, high brown key. Yes, yes, go the developer is just teasing us about the Omega keys. Omega W. So, although we only seem to have a combo black door in the way. It's wait, what the... It's another one of those troll ones that requires both a positive and negative. That's like impossible to open. What? Yeah, what a tease. We're gonna need a gods unlocked thing where the gods that subtract 8 from 8 are removed and now we can like have a key counter that just says 8 minus 8. But I don't freaking when, how are we gonna get that? Well, well, let's see what we can do in this level. We have a bunch of negative pure keys as well as a minus 1 door that costs a actually cost a pure. These that cost the cyan. A bunch of negative purple doors. Which we can easily open a bunch of them by doing this. Hmm. Well, all we need is positive blue to get this one up. And when are we gonna find positive blue? What? There's a brown, I guess. Okay, and we need a ton of negative pure to open and a ton of negative masters. Weird. What? Oh, wait, that's a salvage vent. Hmm. I don't know. Like, let's just go here. So, what do we need to open that? Well, we need to get rid of all our peers. Okay. This is just like clearly binary number counting system, blah, blah, blah. We do that. Well, doesn't that seem like very straightforward? Almost too straightforward? What is this thing? Negative? Oh, freaking damn it. Wait, Master can open that door up. Huh. So I didn't need to turn that into a brown, but maybe I need to do that for the later ones. Hmm. Negative one plus one I. Sure. Not even sure what the brown key is supposed to signify. Like, we can do this. Red is also straightforward looking, where we just open all of them. Because negative 63 is just all of these pure keys going to be added up. Mm -hmm. Although, there's still some pures. I don't know. Also, forgot to open this. Okay. Mm. There's this negative pure door, which cannot be opened by the master key. Yeah, we can open it here. I don't know what, the, what you're asking for with this one. Yeah, I can convert that. Woohoo. Oh, wait. What the? <laughs> so, so, so you can't open it. I mean, sure, that's one way to open an impossible door. Uh, so that's the win. Kind of forgot that was a thing, <laughs> you know, just turning the master. Uh, well, didn't, didn't all of those have pure components or not? Because this does have a pure component, so you can't turn that into a brown by cursing it the same way that we just did. And this is another one of those impossible ones which we talked about before, so what's even going on there? Unless there's a troll where you jump over it. Anyway, the same thing I did with red can be used to turn that into the red door. We'll just do that for green as well because it seems easy. We'll just open red with the exact same thing that we did except we obviously choose to open red instead. Turns to negative 5, which is as expected for that door. That's a door with two blasts on it, so that's why that just it basically acts as a sign flipper. Now we do this. God damn it. Green's methodology seems exactly the same. We just subtract here and here. And now we have enough for a green door. Look at that. And the only other explanation is like it's it's some troll and there's something different about the reason of why we're doing this, you know? Okay, so like we can collect all these for some reason. And set our keys to some arbitrary values of unknown need. What's this door? I need positive red to use that anyway. Minus one copies. Hmm. Oh, right. So we do need negative. Okay, so we're missing orange. We didn't see orange in this level. Or this level. Well, we did see orange in this level. Well, there's nothing that... Everything is pure, but... Should be fine. We have negative orange. Uh, I don't like that we're creating negative orange, though. But we can make it. Here it is. Hey. No. Why does it look jumpable? It's almost W shaped. Omega shaped, obviously. But man, that'd be so freaking funny if there was a larger door. In fact, isn't this a larger door? Hey, 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 hey. We're gonna turn this into a larger door to make this jump. Okay, okay. I'm gonna fall asleep. Which I guess is the point of the level. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the fact that we're gonna have to turn it back, but. Bam! So now, I can jump on this thing, and maybe get above, and, and, uh, uh, 
Um, <laughs> we really are jumping over it. Is there anything on this side? No. Well. Well, then. You got an Omega Key. <laughs> yes, sure. So... It doesn't even- it doesn't even turn on white! Like, what is that? Is it gonna destroy all my need for white lock anywhere, ever? <sighs> How do I return back to hub? Hey, anything- you got anything to say about this? No! Absolutely not! Maybe we can talk about imaginary keys instead, even though we've already seen them. Yes. The imaginary friend. Yes, yes. Sure. I knew what they were before. <laughs> they are neat. Chest battle advanced. Alright. Sure. Let's go, let's check out the, the text for I graduated. We always enjoy VTuber and you speak. Congratulations. <laughs> You're graduated. Yes. Appreciated. The key based subject. Wow. The great key on. <laughs> Yo, what's someone got to do to find a freaking orange in this place? Lost one here. Does this give me a negative orange key, though? I hmm, wonder if I need to save the master for something. As, I mean, okay, we, do, we still don't have a way to get Cyan as far as I know. Maybe I missed one, though. Okay, so now we have negative one orange. But, hmm. Wait, we, we, right, because it's negative. Cause, yeah, okay, sure. So we, then, then we had it the whole time because it created negative orange. Whoops. <laughs> okay, so now we turn this back into red. Uh, hey. Right, blah blah blah. Chess battle advance. Wait, this means that. Wait, first of all, I forgot to do this step, but we didn't get. We, this is still very bad closure about the freaking Omega keys and what they do. Well, anyway, here's our negative orange key, which we need. How do I keep forgetting to do steps here? All right, and now. Oh, we, it's because we have four. Oh my god, we have four pure keys. <laughs> That's this is the reason that this is here, so we can get rid of our pure keys. That's why the negative four is there. My god. Well, here it is, Sunshade Castle. Twenty one all over the place. But we can't. We can't even make it here because we can't jump that gap. So, what? What is the next world? Inside the puzzles. Oh, now they're inside. Now they're outputs. Finally, finally. And now our. We have a pink Omega key at the bottom left. I swear this music was used on the original key pick. You know, the, the where it all started. Anyway, goodbye. Also, let's check out the new some new lore. It's a real joy to explore these worlds. So I was wondering, why did you make this? <laughs> Will you set up for someone real? Just someone else. <laughs> okay. Someone left in came with a dude with a disguise so you can't tell. <laughs> Save file. Imagine sending this game to only one person. That that would be a real first person puzzle game. All right. Your time here is appreciated. Also, here's a Discord server link that breaks your immersion. <laughs> I see puzzles. No. Talk the way you want to, which means without ending in periods. Anyway, bye.